Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Let's Play Persona 4, and let me just show you what I've been doing off screen really quickly. So basically, I spent about 40 hours doing this. I finished the compendium. Yes, absolutely, 100%. Got that nice Lucifer. And you guys will shortly see what is in my repertoire. Because now, we are going to fight the final boss. The goddess herself is an army. Now, I do recommend you have Kanji lost in your team if you're using the same setup as me, and you will shortly see why. Now, this is our last battle, so make sure you have absolutely everything you need. By that, I simply mean um, have everyone have all their moves that you want, at least. That's why I got everyone to level 77, so they have all their moves. And have the personas you want. You'll see which ones I'm going to use. Uh, honestly, I recommend you use the same ones I do, but that's up to you. Congratulations in making it this far. Well, thank you very much, Ms. Root of All Evil. You granted certain individuals the power to enter the TVs. You created the Midnight Channel as well. And lastly, you started a rumor about the Midnight Channel to raise its public awareness. Is this correct? All save one point. This Midnight Channel you speak of? It is indeed a device to draw hearts into this world. But it was always your individual wills that would determine what appeared on it. Humans ache to expose their suppressed sides, while the prying eyes around them are curious to see them lay bare. The want to show, and the want to see. I granted a window that catered to both. That is all. Everyone wished to know more about the people who became famous through the media. And the Midnight Channel was there to grant their wishes. Once the person they wanted to see entered the realm formed by human thought, they would appear even more clearly. I see. So that's how it worked. Are you saying all you did was give that initial spark to Senpai and the others, then watched things unfold? And the rumors spreading, things going wrong. We're to blame for all that's happened? People's curiosity was at fault? Everything was for your sake. To create the world mankind so wanted. Man struggles to understand one another. You can only truly know a finite number of people within your lifetime. But humans disregard this fact, and try to know more people than is possible. Only by comparing yourself to others can you define yourselves. Thus, your ever-present anxiety. Your anxiety causes you to see only what you want to see, and believe only what you wish to believe. As I said, your desire is for a world enshrouded in fog. Don't put words in our mouth. I must agree that the vast majority of people are exactly as you say. But we don't intend to live that way. If we were fine with the world you're making, we never would come this far, damn it. We'll keep searching for truth and figuring out who we are as we go on with our lives. We all will. Together. That's right. No more butting into our business. We will continue to live in our world with everyone else. That's why. We'll put a stop to this.
than this thing. This is just the send-off our leader deserves. All right, time for the grand finale. Knowledge of the truth is not everything. Yet drunk with truth, you exceeded your role and became too involved. Now, learn for yourselves whose wrath you have brought down. This will end it all. We have to believe. Izanami, you may be a goddess, but that's not going to stop me. We're going to start with the debilitate. Jump in with the mind charge. Now it doesn't really matter what order you have Kanji and Yukiko in, as long as you have Naoto second. Because now we need to use Matara Kaja, which means it wears out on, uh, well basically it lasts longer on everybody, which gives Naoto time to power charge, sorry, mind charge. Before the um, gives a time to well, I, I guess I'll just show you, so it makes more sense. We're gonna switch to Lucifer now, who is going to be here to mind charge for us, but not attack because we have some really strong attacks that we really want to show off. Now that okay, Metarakaja lost for three turns. If I mind charge before those three turns start. It means I can do the cycle twice, which is a favorable outcome. Alright, we're gonna go for another Argydon, and we should be doing quite a bit of damage. Yeah, nice. And with Kanji, we just want to go with the, for the primal force because, um, is an army. What's the matter? Did you intend to defeat me with such feeble strength? She doesn't take that much damage from electricity. And a bit later she'll start to drain it. Now, uh, okay, the thing we want to do is switch into Hellel. And what Hellel does wonderfully is Morning Star. Morning Star does massive amounts of almighty damage to everybody. As you can see. We just did a crazy amount of damage. In fact, this is probably the quickest I've like gone through is Anami's HP. So that's pretty cool. I think one more attack and we should be good. But that might just be optimistic. We have one more attack left before um, the Matari Kaja one uh, wears off, so we're going to go for Hesao Tobe. And that was a very nice amount of damage. Um, we can go for Mega Dolan. And yeah, I think we'll be able to do the job by the end of this they Well, there you go. Yeah, as you can see, uh, actually, I may as well just use a Diaharon on Kanji. But I'll show you with Kanji. This is a great example. That you can't actually damage her that much anymore, because... Can you not understand? It is impossible to defeat me. It'll basically just say she's impervious. Alright, so now what we want to do is just guard with everybody. Real nice and real easy. And this is going to go on for about three turns, and then something pretty cool will happen that you guys will see. You understand nothing I see, ignorant mortals. Okay, it's probably a good idea for you to go to heal everybody. Use a salvation. And I think next turn we'll be able to pull off something 
pretty cool. It's either the next turn or the turn after, I'm not entirely sure. But nonetheless, we shall progress. Here we go. At this rate, it will be impossible to defeat his army. You recall what Igor and Margaret told you. That is a crystal of power which you have nurtured through your journey. An ore that repels fabrications of all sorts, dispels lies, and shines upon the truth. Truth is a thing which only appears to those who have observed, considered, and made a choice. At the end of the path you chose lies the truth. Believe in it, and continue without faltering. The orb of sight begins to unmask is Nami's true form. Future. A god? Huh. Bring it on! We've made it this far. We can't lose now! You cannot defeat me with strength alone. Soon, you will understand. Look out! We've never seen anything like her! This is Izanami no Okami. The strongest enemy in the first playthrough of the game. So, we're gonna debilitate. And this is probably the best strategy um, that I can think of, or well, the best strategy I've used. I test ran it um, earlier today, and I went, I won. No, I won pretty quickly. But that is not the point. The point is that we want to be doing a massive amount of damage, and. 300 may not seem like a lot, but when you consider that this is the final boss of the game, yeah, it, it's a lot. Just trust me. Okay, I've been anticipating this Marakunda. Best thing to do? Well, okay, just follow what I do. I'm gonna switch into Yoshitsune, and I am gonna power charge. That's my main character's turn. Okay, now we are going to use Maggie Dolan with uh, Nelto. Do some really nice damage here. Yep. Um, you could go probably do around 400. Yeah, that's actually really good. Now, what Kanji needs to do here is actually scroll down and we need to use the Diamond Shield, which ups our defense. Um, basically, is a. Um, Does the same as that one spell. Now here's the problem. This Nami and no Okami absorbs electricity. What does this mean? Well, it means that if she uses an electricity attack, she gets a bit of health back. Is that terrible? Not really, but... Well, you're gonna see what this does. This is amazing. You cannot deny that that is utterly glorious. Just sub 2,000 damage. 8 times 240. I'm not going to do math right now. It's 1 in the morning. I'm not doing math. But still, that was really, really cool. Um, okay. That should be that. Yeah, it's about half HP now. Yeah, alright, we're going to go and use Primal Force once again because obviously she absorbs zero, so there is no point in using an electricity attack. The stage is already set for your demise. I'll end your lives here. Yukiko Senpai, your agility is down. Now, she will be casting a really, really rude attack in a second. And you'll see what that is. 
but we don't have to worry about that for the moment. Alright, that was still a very nice amount of damage. Let me chuck a Maggie Dolan down again. Surprisingly, our attacks have been very accurate, which isn't a common occurrence when you get to this stage in the fight, because she basically just used a... yeah. We, we should be using Supersonic. And getting a little bit of lag now, that's unfortunate. But I can literally do nothing about that. This is horrible. But as long as Yukiko survives, yes, she did. Okay, we're golden. We have this battle on the back now. If she killed Yukiko, that would be the only complication. Um, but obviously she didn't, so we should be fine. Everyone's got a set move to do. Yukiko's gonna use Salvation in a second. Yeah. Um, wherever, yeah, there it is. Which obviously gives everyone their health 100% back and cures them of any ailments they may have, but thankfully we do not have any of said ailments. Kanji, the man himself, will be able to use Matarakaja. And we're about to get to the best part of the song. Alright, now who I'm going to use is, we're first going to go into Lucifer, and we are going to Mind Judge. Because we are about to do an insane amount of damage, not as much as the Hassel Tobe method, but still quite a considerable amount of damage. And obviously, uh, with everybody else doing around 400, 500 damage, Kanji's case 300, we are doing um, enough to get us by. Stagnant air, yeah, I don't like that. Mind charge, yeah, that's not great. Huh. Oh well, we're gonna go into Satan. Because Satan has another massive almighty attack. But only to one foe, which is the main difference. It's called Black Viper. You're about to see what it does. Just under a thousand damage. It's crazy. But now it's time to finish this battle. Where's Yoshitsune? I am not gonna take this. Take this and die. Okay, they only did one thing of damage. Primal Force. Kill it. Oh crap. Come on, man. This is just fighting dirty. Kanji, no! It's unfortunate that our battle must end this way. 